Fugitive antivirus software tycoon John McAfee arrived safely back in the USA on Wednesday evening after being deported from Guatemala. The 67-year-old had illegally entered the country after fleeing authorities in Belize, who wanted to question him in connection with the murder of his neighbor, Gregory Fall. Guatemala had planned initially on expelling McAfee back to Belize, but last night he was instead flown to Miami airport. A Guatemalan passenger on the plane said that McAfee seemed quiet and restrained on the flight. It was very calm. It seemed just like a regular passenger on the flight. You would never know that, uh, who he was. You would never know. No one uh, had any attention on him. No one was coming to him and asking him things. He was just sitting there. People were taking pictures with him at the airport, <laughs> but that was it. Speaking at the Beacon Hotel after landing, a disgruntled McAfee said that whilst happy to be home, he was not deported to the U.S. out of choice. I don't think I had, I think I had anything to do with this. I had no choice in this. I was, I was whisked out of the prison. I was forcibly separated from Samantha, and here I am. I didn't have anything to do with anything. McAfee has regularly blocked his plight since he went into hiding a month ago, but as of yet has not revealed what he will do now in Florida.